Hi, this is Kaushik and in this video, I'm going to show you how you can add a fuzzy search to your Flutterflow application in less than one minute using Backend Flow. So once you are in Backend Flow, you create your account and this is what you see. This is the project. We call it this project dashboard, right? Now I have created a couple of projects. So I'm going to go into one of my projects and I'm going to go to this menu called fuzzy search, right? Uh, so I'm going to click here. I go access to fuzzy search. All I have to do is click enable this. For those of you who like to know what fuzzy search is, you can read through the description here. Once you have clicked enable, the next thing that you have to do is download the API bundle. So all I do is go and click download the API bundle and I get a zip file which kind of downloads. There you go, the zip file downloaded, right? So I already have my zip file here, so which I'm going to open. So when you unzip, you're going to see list of files that you have enabled or different API services. So I'm going to go after my fuzzy search. So I'm going to just extract it and keep it as a folder in my system. Next. I go into my Flutterflow application and in my Flutterflow application, what I'm going to do is I'm going to go to the API console. Uh, it's a bit slow. There you go. One second. Let's see. Okay. So I'm going to go into my API console. Just click this orange button. In case you are in the paid plan, you have access to importing a YAML file or an open API file directly into Flutterflow. And this is uh, something that Backend Flow already does it for you. So you just download and import it to uh, your Flutterflow. So uh, let it load one minute quickly. Ah, yeah. So with this, you will be able to search through every, any single collection on your database for any given multiple set of fields. For instance, I want to search through the users collection and I want to go through uh, the name, uh, the email, etc. Right, and do certain bit of searching. It is very much possible. It's instant. Uh, you don't need to set up complicated things like Algolia, right? So, okay. So here you go. So I go click import open API. I already have it here, but I'll show you the process. I go click open API and I go upload. And all you have to do is go and select your fuzzy search as an API. And once you import, you're going to see something like this appear on your API console back and flow fuzzy search, right? So I'm going to click here. I'm going to go to the post call. Okay, so everything comes pre-configured. You don't need to do anything. All I do is go here and say, for instance, I want to search through the users collection uh, with, uh, let's say, email, uh, display, underscore name. These are the two fields in my database that I want to search. And I want to search for, uh, let's say, a record name, the hobby, right? And I just test fire my API call. I actually added a limit, uh, which was not there. There you go. You get the results and instantly this is something that it searches for the Hobie app. It gets you the user and this is something that you can directly integrate as an API call in your application. That's it for this video. Stay tuned for the next one. Hope you really enjoyed. Do use Backend Flow to simplify your functional and supercharge your applications uh, and have a great time. Thank you.